What is going on, everybody? It's your boy Chris, aka Mr. 54540 TV in the building. Game, game. Look, man, I'm about to do something that um I've been talking about for a while, but I just haven't, I guess, muster up the muster up. Congratulations, you played yourself. That's some, some North Carolina type stuff, but I, I haven't got myself up to being able to fully do it, you know what I mean? So, I'm actually going to get my feet done. So, I'm going to get my feet done today. And the issue that I have with this is that I'm super ticklish. Like, I don't want to go in there and that lady start touching my feet and I just be like, <laughs> I just like get hysterical in there. So, we gonna see how it turn out, gang. You know what I'm saying? On the way there, we're all gonna talk about a little bit of ways. So, uh, we are actually on the way. I'm actually on the way. I'm meeting Brittany there now. So, I'll be back with y'all after the intro, all right? Peace. Gang, let's talk about a little bit about some ways real quick before I make it to um, this place, this epic place. <laughs> but let's talk about forks. Uh, forks are always caused by improper angles. When you're brushing your hair and you're not hitting the angles correct, um, and the angle that you hit before that, the angle that you're not gonna hit correct is the one that's after that, which is gonna cause the fork in your hair. Now, the best way to get forks removed is one, wolfing, two, using a comb, hard brush, and also, one thing I've noticed, man, and this just me, but, if you don't plastic, if you brush your hair, but you don't plastic bag, those loose hairs are just pretty much any and everywhere. Next thing you know, um, those hairs have grouped up and now cause uh, an issue or imbalance in your pattern. And so, you know, that's what we don't want. So I say to anybody, always plastic bag before you rag up because ragging up don't get you waves. Ragging up actually saves your ways. Um, the ways that you actually got during your brush session, your progress. Um, so I know a lot of people who don't rag up, but I mean, I ain't gonna lie to you. Those who said I don't rag up, they got forks everywhere. Um, so I, I'm not gonna be one of those. I'm gonna definitely rag up. Cause that's just, it would just make more sense for me. I don't want to push myself backwards. You know what I mean? I got a couple forks on my side here that I'm working on. Um, my top is pretty much good to go, um, but I got forks on my side because of um, I switched my pattern in the back. Um, so I had to switch my brush um, strokes on the side, which caused forks on the bottom. I did wolf, I went on a two and a half uh, month wolf. So if you haven't seen that video, make sure you go see that video, it is on my channel. And so I did, uh, you know, knock out a lot of forks. I knocked out a lot of them. I did a lot of combing, more combing than I did brushing. So that's, it, that's exactly how you get that, those forks out of your head. And also too, pick which forks or the easiest forks. The ones near the top are gonna to be the easiest ones because you're gonna push forks to your hairline. So, um, pick which forks are the best forks for you to try to attack. Um, don't worry about the ones at the bottom until you got the ones at the top first because you're gonna push them down. You know what I mean? You're gonna push those forks down. But, um, yeah, attack no forks, man. We all want flawless waves. And we want our ways to flow correctly, you know? They say, um, 
But I've heard it plenty of times also that when you get waves, start working on that crown first. Because think about it. If your waves are good on the bottom, um, you know what I'm saying, and it ain't no issues or whatnot, but if your waves have forks at the top, once you start trying to work those waves, uh, those forks out actually, um, those forks have to move down. They have to move down unless there's a wave that's open that one of those forks can connect to. But majority of the time, those waves, I mean, those forks have to move down. So which means uh, it's going to get worse before it get better. That good side that you thought you had, it's going to be a bad side because that fork got to move down to your hairline. So, yeah, um, let's work on the forks, man. Uh, make sure y'all add me on IG, 540TV. Um, my page is doing real good. Um, a lot of people have followed me from my YouTube videos. So make sure you be one of those to follow me. You know, and I might throw, I, I will throw tips and stuff up there also. But, um, you know, in the comment section, you know, if you have any tips for breaking forks, feel free uh, to come in. Because, you know, I'm all type of person, man. I, you know, I got a YouTube page or whatnot, but you might have something or have a method of breaking forks that I might not know about that might work better. So, you know, hey. I'm willing to uh, hear it out from anybody and try. So, yeah. And again, uh, one, one other thing too, when you're attacking forks, say if uh, the top half of your head is good, but the bottom half is a lot of forks, you know, has a lot of forks. Do not disturb that top half. Do not disturb that top half. You know, what I mean by that is, when you see the forks are forming on the bottom half of your waves, brush that only. Don't brush that top as much. You know what I mean? You can still brush it, but don't hit it as much. Just uh, hit that bottom half. Cause like what I'm doing right now, because my waves are good right here, they're connecting and they're swooping like they're supposed to do. The flow is good. I'm just brushing this bottom half. I've been doing it for two days now, so. I expect to see some kind of progress on my next wolf. So right now I'm brushed because my hair isn't long enough to comb. So when it get to the point where, you know, I'm maybe three three weeks on a wolf, they will start picking up that comb. So I expect my next cut, those ways to be in line, or at least 75% in line, you know what I mean? So again, hey, don't be discouraged by having forks in your hair. We all have had forks at one point, and some of us still got forks. You know what I'm saying? I don't think I've seen, I've seen one perfect waiver, and that was a uh, wavy long way. And I think brownie blends uh, is pretty much uh, flawless, but, and you might know somebody else. If you know somebody else, hit, hit the comment section. But uh, we all had forks, man. Don't be discouraged. You know, waving don't happen overnight. It takes time. You know what I mean? So, all right, man. Look, I'm about to head into this um this place. <sighs> I'm about to head into this place and see how this turns out. All right, I hit y'all back when I get in. All right, so I am headed into this place. Um, five star nails. Me and Brittany here. And it's just weird, man, because there's a bunch of women going in here. Of course, it's a nail, nail and spa type place, but this is going to be super weird. Uh, level 1 to 10, a 10.
Yeah. My first time doing this, actually. Oh, yeah. <laughs>
somebody come look at this. Look at this. Somebody come and look at this. Look at this. Though. Alright, what's up everybody? So I am back. Um, let's talk about this experience at the nail spa. So I liked it. I ain't even gonna lie, like I would literally, really, literally all the LYs on the every word go back. Like for real, for real. I would definitely go back. Um one thing I like, the people who, the lady who was working on my feet, uh, she was cool, she was laughing, joking with me and whatnot. So uh, that always makes a good customer experience. Also too, they gave me some red wine. So I was lit, I'm a little lit right now, but I'm actually here at Chick-fil-A about to give me some food, you know what I'm saying? So I can tone it down a bit, but look man, make sure y'all like, subscribe, hit the post notification bell for all notifications every time your boy upload thank y'all for joining the 540 game those who have already subscribed to the channel uh, we're on our way to 1k um we got i think 1500 watch hours left so i'm gonna start dropping some bangers really soon uh, make sure you view my other videos that's already on my page that's a wave videos um Got a lot of different stuff on my page, so uh, make sure you view that. Check out my playlist and all that, all that good stuff. You know what I mean? Again, this is your boy Chris, aka Mister Five Forty Five Point TV, in the building. Game, game.